What's going on you guys? We're back for another video here today on Burtzall's Automotive. My name is Jay. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. Uh, pretty much, I leaked something in the last video and some of y'all been wondering why, why, why didn't I show it? Why didn't I want to show it? I just wanted to make another video and today we're here to do another video. But as you guys can see, we are in my backyard and I actually have grass now. I haven't actually had grass since I moved in. It was all dirt, but now that fall season is around and I was able to get some grass and a cedar, I was able to plant some grass. And so here's the up and coming roots of the grass and Birdsall's Automotive. Let's get right into the video. Yo, what is going on guys? I'm so excited for this video. And as you can see, here it is. Here is my 14 by seven, I think. No, 16 by seven. 16 by seven enclosed trailer here. We uh, just got it not too long ago, but um, let's, uh, let's go check it out. As you can see guys, um, I have put it in here for storage purposes and I'm not gonna move it for the video just because I don't wanna have to move it back because as you guys can see, it is through an alley and it is a hassle just to move it in and out of the alley. But uh, I had some stuff in it. This is some junk that I'm, I don't need. Uh, it was already in the and, uh, actually, right here is some cardboard boxes that were stored in the trailer. And that was pretty much all that came with it was these little ramp things and these boxes. But um, let's uh, get into the inside and check it out. So as you guys can see, we have the two uh, little doors in the back that I actually don't plan on keeping. I already have like a little route to go, I guess, that I will be removing this and making it a ramp. But I will be keeping these doors just in case I want to go back to these doors. But as of right now, I'm not planning on doing that. But we have some other plans for right now on what we're going to do with it. So I will, I pretty much have been using this for storage just for the last couple of weeks. I pretty much have some extra parts here, an uh, engine stand, a uh, radiator support for my truck, as well as the spare tire here that is just kind of been in storage. This water tank was also, wasn't really included. I didn't realize, I didn't really look it over, but they asked me if I wanted a water tank. I said, sure. It was sitting out by the trailer when I went to look at it and it ended up being in here. It's not something I'm gonna keep. I have this receiver hitch here that I also, it's for sale. I don't want it, I already have. A few of them and then obviously I don't know if you guys know this but I have my truck and I plan on swapping the wheels three of them are done y'all just seen the color and everything so yeah anyway I have this skylight roof top on here and this is pretty much the trailer these lights actually don't work currently and I don't know if that's the battery issue, a wiring issue, or if these bulbs are bad, but we're gonna figure that out. But 
we have some other plans. First, we are going to replace the lighting, but not today. In fact, today isn't going to be really anything doing with the, with the trailer, but the trailer's plans, I guess you could say, and what I'm going to do with it. So, I have failed at just doing it on the side, and I want to build a business. So, my plan is actually to move this into a mobile tire shop and I guess mobile service shop doing tires as well as oil changes and stuff on the go so that customers can have a better like experience, better day. So then they don't have to go to the shop, bring their car to the shop, figure out a way back to work, whatever. They can just call me up and I can go to them their work and get the job done and won't be too loud since it's in a trailer but that is actually my plan to do with this trailer um, but to start I have to obviously empty all this out sweep it all up and then uh, figure out if all this flooring is good if this is a leak or that is a leak that hasn't been fixed I need to fix that and then um, I actually plan on painting these walls here, splitting down at the bot at the little at this little board here. We're gonna go with a gray color all the way across here, as well as the back, and then right where this base board or whatever this middle board is, that will be a red color, just like on this logo here. It will be the same type of color as my logo and then on top of here this will all be in white and then obviously I plan on getting some flooring finished and done probably epoxy flooring but I'm not really sure on how easy it is to do that with it being a wood flooring I know you have to paint it and paint it and paint it it's going to be a lot of coats but I'm, I'm thinking I'm willing to do that for the right look. So I just want it to be like a shop look, but obviously in a trailer. So that is actually my plans for the trailer. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for the plans on the trailer. There's going to be some moves here on the outskirts. All the lights and everything work already. I just plan on making it a little better on appearance wise uh, whether that's going to be painting it or not obviously a Bertels automotive logo would look sick on the side of this thing as well as some black accents because y'all know i love the color black as you can see my outfit today is all black so that is going to go on to uh end this video thank you all for all the love and support on the last couple of videos Thank you all for watching and subscribe if you guys are new and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Peace.